To use the spotlight as an intrusion deterrent, navigate to your NVR's alarm tab. Then select the deterrent tab at the top. Now select the setup icon for the channel. The spotlight field should be set to enable. Then use the slider to set your desired brightness. The light duration field allows you to change the length of time the spotlight is active after motion detection. Next, select your desired light mode. You can choose from warning light or strobe. In the siren field, you can enable or disable the camera siren function. The siren level field allows you to increase or decrease the siren's audible level to suit your taste. In the siren duration field, enter your preferred duration for the active siren between 5 and 180 seconds. The sensitivity field alters how sensitive the spotlight and siren will be when your NVR is detected motion, independently from your NVR's motion detection. This allows you to record motion on the NVR as usual, but not trigger the siren until an object comes into closer proximity with the camera. To create a new detection area, delete the current detection area by clicking and dragging from the yellow cell to the bottom right corner. Then click and drag to create a new area. Now, movement in the detection area will trigger the siren and spotlight. Note that you can create multiple detection areas if you desire. Then right click to exit, and then select apply. Select the schedule field setup button to change the default spotlight and siren trigger schedule. The default schedule does not allow the spotlight or siren to trigger between the hours of 6.30 a.m. and 4.30 p.m. To alter the schedule, click on a square to enable or disable the spotlight and siren for that time in 30-minute increments. Then select Save. To activate the siren or spotlight manually, open the Swan Security app. Then navigate to the channel's live view and tap on the light bulb to activate or deactivate the spotlight and the bell to activate or deactivate the siren.